let's first talk about Castle Rock a little bit. Um, you get to play uh, someone a little creepy, creeping around, lurking. Yeah. Uh, how did this come to you? You know, it, like many of these things do, you know, it's like it just kind of popped up in the in my inbox window and was like, hey, do you want to look at this and see if this might be something that would be right for you? And uh, and it was, I, 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 I'd never really done anything that was so, um, like Stephen King's such a huge part of the kind of literary tapestry of, of, of our lives and so it seemed sort of cool mm -hmm. and a little daunting to to be a part of something that he was doing and then i watched the first season and i thought oh wow they make this look really good this is like good this show's creepy and and good but they pick good actors and oh, yeah. the scripts are good and uh, uh the cast so, in this season is incredible yeah yeah like, and all and, around and it they add more as the season progresses yeah i i it's been a really like awesome uh, experience. Um, I've never really done like too much horror. I think maybe you know the first cruddy movie I ever made. You know the indie film I made was probably horror. What was it? I, 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 what was it called? It was called uh, Headspace. <laughs> I think it's anyway. Wait, what was your part <laughs> no, in Headspace? No, you know, Here I was the go, guy. Paul. No, in, in Headspace, I play the character that's not the bad guy. He's kind of the dick. Can you say that? Yeah. You probably can't say that. Sure. Yeah. yeah um, and uh, he's the one that's like, why is everybody running around? Right, right. Like, what's going on? Why is everybody so sweaty and, and upset? He gets his head cut off. And then he like turns into a monster and like rips someone in half. <laughs> like that's what that's what I that's what I did. 